Hi guys, welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 update for the main release, which is the past Tuesday or the monthly release for the month of December for Windows 11, the main release. In this video, we're talking about the build 22631.2861 or KB5033375. Of course, this update is for version 23H2, as on this channel, we're only covering the latest version of Windows 11. So in this video, we're going to cover everything that is new and some little updates that you have to know before the end of the year. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, what you need to know is that this is the last update for the main release in the year 2023. We won't have a C release or a non-security release for the month of December. So this is the last update for Windows 11, the main release in the year 2023. And Microsoft, of course, plans to release other updates at the beginning of 2024. As always, the B release or the past Tuesday addresses security issues for the Windows operating system. And in the article below, you're going to be able to see an in-depth list on the Microsoft website of what security improvements and fixes were applied to the OS. Of course, this update also has all the new features and improvements from the C release from the month of November. So in that, you mainly have Windows Copilot improvements, for example, Windows Copilot in all the tab, and also some other keyboard shortcuts that you can use inside Copilot. Also, we can now use Copilot for 10 times before having to log into a Microsoft account. So I think that is also pretty nice. And all around improvements to the reliability of Windows regarding the start menu, Microsoft Store, and also File Explorer. If you want to see the in-depth list of what was changed in the C release, you can check out the article below in the video description if you're interested in that. And of course, we're also getting the Windows 11 Service and Stack update with the build 22631.2567, which ensures that you have a robust and reliable service and stack so that your devices can receive and install Microsoft updates. So basically, this is pretty much all there is to it. There are not a lot of new things. Of course, this is the past Tuesday, the security release. So as I've said, a short reminder, this is the last update for Windows 11 23H2 on the main release in the year 2023. I think it was a good year. We had a lot of new improvements and a lot of new updates. So I think all around that was a good year. Of course, please don't forget to check out the article below for more info on the website if you're interested. This was the video for today. I hope you liked it. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. This is Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.